Hi, I'm Paula Vincent Johnson, your notary in the East. Today you're going to learn something about the types of wills that are recognized in Louisiana. Your last will and testament is an extremely important legal document. In Louisiana, there are only two types that are considered valid. That's the Olographic Testament, which is very informal, and the Notarial Testament, which is very formal. There is nothing in between. The Olographic Testament must be entirely handwritten, dated, and signed by the testator, the person making the will. And it must be clear that the testator intends for the document to be his last will and testament. It can't be just some handwritten note, and it definitely should not be notarized. That's right, I said an Olographic Testament should not be notarized. Now this all may sound easy enough, but you must be extremely cautious if you're going to write your own testament. Actually, I say just don't do it. Most people do not understand the law well enough to prepare their own testament. There are things that you can and cannot do with the testament. You might not execute it properly according to the law. And guess what? A judge could find an oligraphic testament invalid even if nobody contests it. My notarial opinion? Don't do it yourself. It could cost your family far more problems, anxiety, stress, and money than if you had just let a Louisiana legal professional help you get it right. But if you insist on writing an Olographic Testament for yourself, you can't write one for somebody else, then do the research and make sure you understand what you can and cannot do under Louisiana law. Okay, the other will considered valid in Louisiana is the much more formal Notarial Testament, which is prepared and signed in accordance with the very strict requirements of Louisiana law. Again, I suggest that you do not type it up yourself. There are certain language and clauses that must be in the Testament. It must be signed and dated in the presence of a notary and two witnesses. There are certain formalities that must be observed during the signing or the testament will be invalid. And there are other specific requirements for special circumstances. For instance, if a person is physically unable to read or write, does not know how to read and write, and is deaf or blind or both. If you've been saying for years that you're gonna get your will done, then stop procrastinating and get it done before it's too late. If you think you need legal advice, then I urge you to contact a competent attorney authorized to practice law in Louisiana. But if you know what you want done, then make one day this day. Give me a call to schedule a free telephone conference so that we can discuss how I can assist you as a notary republic. The process is much easier than you think. If you like the information that you just received, then please subscribe. When you subscribe, it helps promote this channel so that the people you care about can more easily find and access the information that you just received. Also, click the thumbs up button to like this video and don't forget to click the bell so that you can be notified when new information is available. Connect with me on Facebook and Twitter where I give quick answers to your quick questions. And visit my website at notaryintheeast.com. There's a lot of information there that I think you'll find very helpful. And while you're there, you can join my email list so that you can periodically receive exclusive news, tips, and information about all types of notarial transactions that regularly affect your life. When you connect with me, I promise you'll learn something. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you. I'm Paula Vincent Johnson, your notary in the East.